Hi, Jim Young here to talk with you about Trico's Optimatic Oilers. We have two variations of the Optimatic Oiler, the standard vented and the closed system Optimatic. When you receive a standard vented Optimatic Oiler, there's a number of key components that you should be aware of. First, to take apart the Optimatic Oiler, there's a thumb screw on the back that loosens and takes the oiler apart. Inside you will find the level adjuster assembly. This is a very important part that people often throw away and I want to make you aware that this is a critical component to making your Optimatic work correctly. So make sure that you save this part. The last part is the plug that goes into the back or the bottom depending upon the, the way that you would like to mount your Optimatic oiler be it in the side of the bearing housing or to the drain port underneath. To begin, by opening your Optimatic oiler and taking the level adjuster assembly, there's two wing nuts on here. Be sure to set your wing nuts together tightly at the level in which you would like to set the oil level in your bearing housing. So the upper, the upper casting and portion bottle assembly of the Optimatic oiler is going to rest on this level adjuster assembly. The two wing nuts tighten together in order to hold the position at that point. Once you have that set, place the level adjuster assembly back inside the lower casting, reapply the bottle top, and retighten the knurled thumb knob on the back. If contamination control is a bigger concern to you, then Trico's closed system oiler is a better option. The closed system allows for the exchange of the oil from within the oiler and the makeup air all to exist within the system itself. So the makeup air that comes into the oiler to offset the exchange of oil comes from within the headspace as compared to the outside environment with, standard, with the standard vented Optimatic. To set the closed system, take the upper bottle reservoir apart and you'll notice on the lower reservoir assembly there is a sliding sleeve. This allows you to set the oil level at the bottom level of this sleeve. So adjust it to the point at which you would like it. Tighten the hex or allen screws on the side. Reapply the upper bottle assembly until the casting sits securely against that lower sleeve. Then tighten the knurled thumb knob on the bottom. The closed system, like the standard vented, has two mounting options either from the back to the side of the bearing housing or from the bottom to the bottom drain port of a bearing housing. A plug is provided to seal the other port not being used. Above the back port you will notice that there is a, a threaded uh, insert for a fitting that accepts a quarter inch tube and connects to the top of the bearing housing for that air exchange that we, we talked about earlier. The Optimatic Oiler has remained relatively unchanged since the 1930s when it was developed by my great-grandfather Oscar Young and still remains a part of lubrication management practices today. If you have more questions about lubrication or relubrication or Trico Standard Vented or Optimatic Oiler, please give us a call.